first one is more about the one on vacation. Yes, and if you remember, I don't remember which episode we talked about it in, but we discussed a recent case, I believe that happened in January, uh, originally. There's a bunch of cases. Right, so we talked about a specific case. Yeah, 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 um, but yeah, this woman, she got, she got like dragged right, into a right. closet um, by a bunch of employees and just like completely beaten, like, yeah. horribly beaten. And um, they haven't, she lived, luckily, but they haven't figured out who it was. And the Dominicans have been really bad about the whole situation. They've had issues with the police. Um, so we kind of put out a little warning about that. Yeah, but not only that, there's been these like very weird, kind of isolated deaths that have been happening mm-hmm. throughout the year as well. People actually dying while vacation on the Dominican Republic. And we're not sure if the deaths are connected or not, but the fact that people are just randomly kind of dropping dead, a lot of the official cause of death is natural causes, but the family members are like, that's really weird. Yeah. Why would, you know, there's, there seems to be a trend here. There's something affecting people in these resorts and it's different resorts, which is also interesting. It's not isolated to one resort, but all of so, you know, the FBI started looking to actually this week and started to basically investigate these deaths because there's nine now. Um, a man named Kevin uh, Joseph Allen, he just yeah. died on uh, the 13th. Right. And he's curious, like, he apparently, the family members just said he got sick and he, like, went to his room and he never really came out again. Like, yeah. it's just, like, very, very weird. And they're saying natural causes are never, uh, there's a preliminary reason for death, but it seems like there's something else going on. And kind of other resorts are more than, um, some of the theories are out there that insecticides are being put through their air conditioning system as results. Oh, um, that's one reason, which possibly. I've heard a lot of people talking about alcohol being a source of it. Yeah, that, you know, especially these resorts, they use such, a lot of these really cheap, shitty alcohols. Some of them will even water it down. So who knows what else they're putting in it? What if they're putting water in it that's contaminated to water the beverages down? I mean, who knows? It's really awful. Are they doing autopsies on these people? Yeah, they are. A lot of the families are bringing bodies back to the US for autopsies. Okay, okay, okay. haven't done them yet. So we'll follow this story for sure because I'm curious to see if anything's found, like maybe a parasite or like. Maybe, yeah, there could be. Yeah, it's a good point. They're just really weird and random. Yeah. That's down there right now. That's affecting people. Honestly, this is a very small department because people have been around for a very long time. I know what I can name a few. Just mostly beautiful. I know. Yeah, we've never been down there. It's a very good point. It's a extremely affordable beach destination. You know, we're going to get so long to go. It's also beautiful and people are great, but yeah, there's these weird deaths. And, and you have to worry about that sketchiness of not being able to hold the, like, have to hold the hotel yeah, accountable for yeah, things yeah, in there because right. you have lack of support from the police. There's different laws. You're in a different country, and so yeah. their rules apply. So you're not yeah. getting like American treatment like people are used to for resorts here. Are there even resorts here? No, not, not like all inclusive, really. Yeah, there's not a sort of, yeah, but it's like, still a resort. Oh, yeah. It's a good one. Oh, yeah. It's a good one. 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 It's a good